Got his leg tweaked a little bit. Some of the coming all the way from New York to you know to fight Ashley and go back and get checked out. Hopefully he's all right. the ladies coming up next yes i'm looking forward to this fight um, lindsey valentine she's coming all the way from new york to you know to fight ashley and ashley's coming up from grand prairie but i talked to lindsey in the back and she said that all she's had on her mind for a good while is this fight Known she was going to fight, isn't taking anything short notice. So she's known she's going to fight for a while. She said she's coming ready. I always like to watch the ladies fight. So who are you going with, the debut person or the 0 and 6? Valentine or Frencher? I don't know anything about either one of them. But I am not going to pick either one. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, like you, Justin you Christie. You know, hey, guys, I just want to thank every single one of y'all for coming out here and supporting our local I don't want to hurt any fighters, feelings, and I also don't sponsors. like being wrong. Right. <laughs> I want to give a quick shout-out to our sponsors and, and say a special thank you from us, uh, from myself, Justin Christie, from Fast Productions Media, from OKC Cannabis, the Oklahoma Kickboxing Championship. Thank you all so much. Uh, Faded Minds out here, uh, rocking it with their vendor booth over here. Uh, they, they came in for Cannabis 1, and they're back for Cannabis 2, so thank you guys so much for your continued support. Check out their dispensary in Edmond. Uh, they got a lot of great deals, uh, obviously not for sale on Facebook or on Fight TV. You know, you got to go see them in person. Uh, they're better in real life. <laughs> I love you guys. Thank you all so much again. Uh, shout out to Patches and Plugs right there, uh, just out in front of Whiskey Nights. Uh, th they last minute they you know donated a couple bucks for us so we can uh, you know open the doors. So I mean every little bit helps. Every little bit that you can support local MMA, I really in, in local martial arts, local kickboxing, local fights, boxing, and everything. Uh, shout out to Don Hickey Used Cars and Trucks for donating to help us get this show going. Uh, Peak Nutrition uh, for hosting our weigh-in ceremony yesterday. Go check them out. Fifty-two thirty uh, North Meridian Avenue. Uh, they got some great delicious uh, teas and shakes as well. Uh, Route 66 Liquors and Cigars in El Reno for their continued support. They're family to us. Thank you, Dana. We love you guys. Uh, Jess Sosa's photos right here, our lovely photographer for the evening. She is amazing. She was an Oompa Loompa yesterday. And today, today, today she just, you know, what do we got? Team Liam. Oh, my God. Oh, you want to break my heart? I, uh, okay. <laughs> Check her out. She's great for photography for uh Uh, if you guys need a photographer for your weddings or for any kind of events that you have, check out Jess Sosa Photography. She does great editing, great videos, great photos, all that stuff. So check her out. Uh, Nightfall Haunted Territory at Lost Lakes Adventure Park. Our last venue for Cannabis One, Lost Lakes Adventure Park. It's located, uh, what is it, 3400? It's on Northeast 10th Street just by Bryant and Sooner, between Bryant and Sooner. Uh, they have a haunted territory, so they're going to be going all the way through Halloween. So I highly suggest to go check it out. Get there early so you can get a good spot. Uh, you get the shit scared out of you. It's going to be awesome. Um, Oklahoma Boxing and Combat Sports. They're going to be having an event next week, November 6th, at the Oklahoma City Farmers Public Market. Make sure you get your tickets from stubwire.com from them. Uh, you know, or you can contact Maurice Williams over there at uh, – uh, Knockout Nutrition on 50th and Rockwell. Uh, they got a, an awesome uh, nutrition store up there, so check them out. A lot of great professional and amateur boxing matches. Boxing is back here in Oklahoma City, guys. Whiskey Nights right here, this bar. They're going to be rocking it out all weekend long. Uh, tomorrow night, they're going to have a $500 costume contest. $500 to the winner, whoever wins the costume contest tomorrow. So come on out, check that out. October 31st, Halloween, they're going to have Struggle Jennings out here, so make sure you come out here and support, get your drink on, and get your party on with Struggle Jennings. That, if, For those of you who don't know, that's Waylon Jennings' grandson. 
So they got Struggle, you got Shooter, and they got Waylon as well. So check that out. We got a special thanks to Grateful Med Dispensary just right down here on the block. Uh, they're, they're absolutely amazing. If you guys uh, are looking for uh, medical marijuana, go down there, and uh, they're just right down the road or just right down the block in this, uh, this same complex. So go, go check out Grateful Med Dispensary and Up and Smoke Smoke Shop. Uh, we want to, for those of y'all who are hungry, we have Ma's Hen House food trucks just right outside. Make sure you get you some delicious food from there. And uh, thank you again to Pro Security for all your help, uh, keeping everybody safe, keeping ev all this stuff regulated and keeping the rules happening. We're going to be getting started with our co-main event of the evening here in just a minute. It'll, what? Uh, okay, sorry, I saw somebody was talking to me. Our co-main event of the evening will be for our inaugural women's what? mass production. Okay. Our co-main event of the evening will be for our wi inaugural women's lightweight championship, 155-pound women's lightweight championship. These two women have been training their tails off. Uh, one, uh, one of them drove all the way from New York, uh, East Mauritius, New York, to fight for this title. So we, our titles are coveted in the Northeast. So I'm, I'm super excited. That's an honor to have people want our belts from all over. I got pros wanting our amateur belts right now. Uh, for those of y'all wondering when Cannabis 3 is, we don't have a, a definitive date. We are looking for something in January. So make sure you follow Oklahoma Kickboxing Championships on Facebook and at OKC Cannabis on Instagram. And we will make those announcements soon. We will be having our first pro fights in January. So make sure you oh check that out. Oh, yeah. We'll be having pro champions and everything. So those pros that want those belts are going to be getting some cool belts. All right. Uh, shout out to Fast Productions Media for any, uh, any kind of production you need. Events, weddings, all kinds of stuff. We do photography. We do videography. We do all kinds of lighting, rigging. Uh, whatever you need, anything you need for your events, check out Fast Productions. And you can check them out at Fast Productions Media on Facebook.com. All right, guys. I'm going to give it back to our ring announcer. And what do you all think of Austin Slaughter here? He's amazing, right? Yeah, let's give it up for him. He's also a comedian as well, so make sure you follow Austin Slaughter on social media and go go to his events. Every little bit helps him as well. Sure, man. That's just Justin, Justin Christie, one of the all right, ladies that keep and gentlemen. Wheel rolling around as here. we make our way back to our seats, and I make my way back up here onto the ring here. We're gonna get this party continuing. You know what? I'm going to do it. I'm, I'm going to do it. Sir? Sir, will you, will you hand me one? One, one of those? One of those? Biden That's right. Seven. I got another shirt to give away. Yeah. That's right. Over here. I also have lights in my eyes. You have a plenty good shirt on. All right. You get it. This is all you. If they would have taken it, they would have had it. All right. Hey, Justin. Kayla West, what's up over here in the corner selling, did you say candles? Candles and doing tarot card readings. Those things go together hand in hand. So go get a candle and find out if you should do that thing or not do that thing. Not a, not a tarot reader, but still good advice. All right. Are you guys ready? Yeah. Pruitt, are you ready, sir? This guy's ready. What about over here? You guys all – you know what? You're busy. All right. Coming at you at the blue corner. Weighing in at 153.2 pounds. All the way from Grand Prairie, Texas. Make a little noise for Ashley Treacher.
Well, this is going to be a five round fight, so let's see what happens. And her opponent in the red corner, weighing in at 153.0 pounds from East Mauritius, New York, Lindsay Ann Valentine. This is our second to last fight. Stay pumped, you guys. Here we go. All right, we're going to watch and this. Here we go, fight. round one. Take a good look at that belt right there. That's our Canafist belt. Got our women's here title fight go. right here. Round one, girls' lightweight title. We got Lindsay all the way from New York. Should be a good fight. Valentine with some good shots early. Oh, they're both swinging. Swinging for the fences. I don't think this is going to go the distance. <laughs> I could be wrong. I think they both want this. They're, they're both winging them. Yeah. Step into Throws kind of calm down a little bit now. Oh, nice combo by Ashley. Like they're slowing down a little bit. Followed up with the knee. Oh. Whoa. Ate a nice left head kick. Ref as she wants to continue, says yes. Here we go. 10 seconds. All right, here they go. And that's time. Lindsay winging it at the bell. Heck of a, heck of a round one. That was a good first round. I've got to give that to the blue corner. Agree. Yeah, yeah, very could have easily scored that last one a knockdown for. This is a five round. Yeah. Be anxious to see if these girls keep up that same pace in the second round. Lindsay for Seconds sure out. had the longest drive to get here, coming down from New York. That's kind of, I mean, that's, yeah, that's a little ways. <laughs> here we go. <laughs> Round two. <laughs> nice. 
Nice exchange early in the round. Malice in Wonderland. Nice. You know, this girl fight's been one of the most promoted fights on the card, and so far it's, it has not disappointed. They're That's getting a great after card, it. Great card. We've had really exciting fights this whole this whole time. Yeah, great matchmaking. Yes. Yes. Everybody likes to see the ladies fight though. Oh yeah. <laughs> Ashley switched chances on her there. <laughs> Valentine went for that thigh push kick. Yeah, nice left hand by Lindsay. Just kind of got Ashley thinking about it. Oh, she saw that one coming. Coming with them combos. Trading the leather now. Ten seconds. Oh, we got blood. Got some blood out of Valentine. Out of the nose. Time. Still swinging though. Yeah, Lindsay looks like she's hurt. Yep. In the market for a used car and truck, out. check out Don Hickey's used car and James trucks. James Rush going to talk to her a little bit and see how she feels about continuing. She said she's good to go. I tell you, looking at both girls in the corner, they both look look gassed. So it's just there. It's going to be a battle of wheels this last. But this is a five-round fight, isn't it? This is a five-round yeah, that was, we're getting ready to start three. Yes, ma'am. I get so into it, I forget where, where we're at. I'm just like, ah. Yeah, I'm just, it's exciting. <laughs> I'm like, ooh, punching the air over here. Watch out, Anthony. Whoa. I'm swinging at the air. Oh, Watch out, Fred. <laughs> getting Seven a little wild out. over here. I'm covered up like a turtle. <laughs> yep. Going to my shell. <laughs> I'm sitting right in the middle of these guys, too. Best seat in the house. <laughs> Lindsay looks like she kind of got her wits back about her. Round three. Here we go. James Pruitt starting it off. See if that nose becomes a factor. Valentine's a really tough fighter. She seems to fade about halfway through the round. She comes out strong and then and she's getting a little winded. And after she uh, loses a step, Ashley's just pouring it on. Oh, she got her hand hung in the rope. She's still winging him. She's still throwing. Yeah, she's she's landing too. Mm -hmm. you know. Oh, that's good push kick. <laughs> Make Ashley think twice about rushing in. Mm-hmm. 
nothing but heart from, from Valentine. Oh yeah, she's she's ten seconds. Uh, she took a good knee. What was that? That should have been a stand. And that's time. I'm a little confused myself. Yeah, that should have been a standing eight. It looked like he stepped in to stop the fight and then changed his mind. I concur. I Coming believe in round four. a mistake on the referee's Here part. We go. He wasn't quite sure of himself. Well, championship rounds, let's see who, who wants it more. It seems like every round, I, Lindsay's came out and uh, and been the aggressor the, for the first 45 seconds of each round, and then Ashley just with her con continued pressure walks her down and you know yeah, takes like the, the second half of the round. Giving her some instructions here. Seconds out. Just telling her to defend herself. She's definitely putting up a heck of a fight for you know coming all the way from New York. She's. Yeah, both of them are doing a great job. She is uh, saying, boy, these girls handling herself well. I think if Ashley would just get on her, she could probably put her down. Lindsay's coming out swinging. Oh, yeah. They both have some power. Yeah. They both came to fight. And both of them are trying to take that belt home. His best round of the match so far. She found her fire, I think. Come on, ladies. Ashley's using that jab on her pretty good. Jab hook, whatever you want to call yeah, it. Yeah, she's, <laughs> she's twisting it in there at the end. Oh, good one. Nice push good. kick by Valentine. Nice. She's a game fighter. Yeah, they're both mm -hmm. in there to, to win. Ah, slip. Caught in the ropes. Man, she's, she's putting up a hell of a fight. Yeah, yeah, she's wearing down, but... She's still fighting. Mm-hmm. She's still landing, too. That was a definite knockdown yeah, out that was there. Definitely knockdown. Ten seconds. Then we got Ashley that's out of Texas. and I think she's going to finish this round out. Yeah, yeah. This, this fight, is fight's good. And it's going to last and round. And that's time. This is Ashley's around. debut. Yeah, that's her debut. She looks good. Let's see showing by Valentine. Ashley has just put the pressure right, on her. Final round brought to you by just the whole time. Nutrition. You know, she, she's taking everything Valentine's hit her with. Some, some, good, uh, some good hooks to the head. Some good push kicks. She just walked through it. Just continues to put and the pressure on her. Referee's over there watching, watching Lindsay really close. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she's all heart. You know, she's not going to quit. You got, sometimes you have to look out for a fighter, you know, protect them from themselves. This is true. I hope she can. I've had to do that right, several times as a referee, and it's no fun. Final round. Here we go. Oh, yes, yes. I hope she can make it through. She deserved to. You know, whatever the judges say. She deserves to stand up there at the end with, with the announcement. Yeah, I agree with that. She's put up a great fight. It's not over yet. She can still win. She can knock her out. Mm -hmm. Yes. I don't yes. see Most it. girls still trying to win. It, but All right, here we swinging. go. Here we go. Championship round. Let's see who's going to take this. She's not quitting. There's no quit in her. No. Lindsay. No. 
not even a tiny bit. That's what I love about watching the ladies too. They just, you know, they 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 put it all out there on the floor and they fight hard. Yep, they sure do. I'd like to see some combos. There we go. Some leg kick. They're both kind of tired. They're both, you know, mm -hmm. going slow down a little bit. Seems like both of them just looking for an opening for a flurry. There it goes. Good, go. That was a good right. Valentine, there is the action. looping right. She's still trying to win. Who's gonna take it? Ten, Ten seconds. Ten seconds. Who wants it more? Come on, ladies. Oh. And that's oh. time. They ended it swinging. They ended it swinging. I've got to give that round of applause for these fighters quarter. right here. Well, they win all their rounds for sure. That was not a disappointing fight at all. No, no. I, I think Ashley, I think Ashley took it, but Valentine. You know, put a, a valiant effort, was in there the whole time, was in there trying to win it, landed some good shots in every round. Every round she'd, she'd come out and, uh, you know, she put forth a really, a really we strong have our effort. Winner. Yeah, she definitely earned the, the crowd's respect for sure. Mm hmm. I actually haven't seen one disappointing fight tonight at all. I would not want to be the guy that decided fight of the night for this. This yeah, this right. be hard. by unanimous decision. You're gonna have eight out of eight, the blue corner. Upset make some at noise you. for Ashley Treasure. That was kind of the way we've seen it. Yeah, well deserved. What win an for amazing Ashley. fight that was. Great fight. Yeah, she had to earn that one. You know, mm. Valentine came to fight. Oh yeah, she definitely earned it. I think we'll see her again. And new women's lightweight champion. Let's hear it. It's a nice looking belt. That's Justin Christie and Thine Leg in the ring with their Thine D. Keen Leg. Along with referee James Pruitt. Lovely piece of hardware she's got around her waist now. She's going to stand there and take a few photos with it. That is a nice piece of hardware. I think the commentators deserve some hardware. <laughs> Especially you two for having to put up with me all night. That, that's alcohol. My pleasure. <laughs> It's always a pleasure working with both of you guys. I always look forward to working with you. And now Fred. I've really enjoyed myself being around both of you. Enjoyed the night. Sitting around some good good fights, sitting around some good knowledgeable people. Hope we get to see you fight one day. Me too. Me too. I have to we got a few words from Hopefully from, uh, Oklahoma Lindsay will get it legalized pretty monitor, soon. Bloody Valentine right here. She wanted us to say a few words here. Take home the win. Holy shit, Ashley is a freaking incredible fighter. Damn, dude. 
No one's hit me as hard as you. Um, I drove all the way from New York for this. Maybe I'm crazy. I don't know. I want to thank my sponsors and everybody who supported me, everybody from Oklahoma, every, everywhere. I want to thank my, my girlfriend. Come here. Without you, none of this would be possible. I'm doing this. I just want to just ask you something, though. I Holy shit. I oh, what? I what? believe we're getting a proposal. She's getting the hardware of the night, looks like. Yeah, it looks like it. Can you marry me? <laughs> she said yes. We're good for that. I'm not crying. You're crying. She said yes, ladies and gentlemen. We're making moments here at OKC Cannabis. Hey, come here, come here, come here. Full deal. We gotta get a picture with with our photographer. She said yes. The first ever post. Or, uh, she is now engaged. Photo. We're so proud of you guys. Congratulations, congratulations, lovers and fighters. There we go. There we go. There we go. You never know what's going to happen at OKC Cannafist. We have fighters coming in all the way from New York to fight for these belts. Look at that. All the best to her. She came out warriors, and put on a good show for the fights. Absolute freaking warriors. We got a new champion. Let's say congratulations once again to Ashley Trecher. The woman of the now, night. I do have to say one thing. You won this fight. This has been Malice in Wonderland. You are now, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hold you to this. This is your new nickname. You are the queen of hurts. She is now the queen of Hertz. Congratulations. We love you. Well-deserved victory. We got one more fight, ladies and gentlemen. It'll be our main event of the evening to determine the inaugural heavyweight title. I'm going give, to give it back to our amazing...